Hello, nonfiction and STEM fans. This is Kirsten Larson, author of Wood Wire Wings, Emma Lillian Todd Invents an Airplane, here with another nonfiction or STEM book review. And today I am reviewing um, a book that I have been waiting and waiting and waiting with bated breath to uh, read the beautiful Digging for Words. Jose Alberto Gutierrez and the Library He Built. This is by um, Angela Burke Kunkel, a dear friend of mine, and exquisitely illustrated by Paola Escobar. Um, so this uh, book is based on the true story of a garbage man um, who went around town and dug books from the trash. Actually, he still does this. I shouldn't say it in the past. And then created a library that he opened up to his community. So um, I'm going to have to juggle devices here because um, I have the digital F and G and I cannot read it on my iPad. Um, but I want to show you how this beautiful book begins. So I didn't realize this about the book, but it's actually um, a parallel story of two Jose's, which is really, really cool. Um, so in the city of Bogota, in the barrio of La Nueva Gloria, there lived two Jose's. Little Jose stirs in his bed. The early morning light wakes him. He was dreaming of paradise. It is Friday, he realizes with a sigh, almost Saturday. So we're introduced to this young child in Bogota named Jose. And we, we see a little bit about his normal weekday routine. And then we meet the second Jose, the subject of this biography. In the same neighborhood, a few streets away, another Jose understands long days too. He left school as a boy, his mama unable to afford it, and went to work as a bricklayer. Um, so basically, uh, Angela starts to talk about um, Jose Alberto Gutierrez and what prompted him to build his library. So the cool thing about this um, book is it goes back and forth between the two Jose's and their weekday and what happens and then Saturday when they actually come together when little Jose goes to the library that uh, the older Jose built. Um, so this book was released simultaneously in Spanish and English and I um, have been studying Spanish for a few months, doing a horrible job at it, but I'm looking forward to trying to read it in Spanish so that I can work on my Spanish a little bit. But even the English um, version is sprinkled with uh, Spanish words um, that you kids can, uh, and adult readers can figure out in context. Um, so the really cool takeaway for this book is um, the idea that anybody can make a difference um, in their community and also the real power of books to make change in people's lives and the world. So I really cannot uh, recommend this book enough. Um, Digging for Words, um, simultaneously released in English and Spanish. It's by Angela Burke Kunkel, beautifully illustrated by Paula Escobar.